Life and Immortality by James Beattie. Oh, you wild groves, oh, where is now your bloom? The muse the priest was his tender fort. Your flowers, your verdure, and your balmy gloom, of late so grateful in the hour of drought. Why do the birds that song and rapture brought to all your bowers the mansions now forsake? And why is fickle chance with ruin wrought? For now the storm holds mournful through the break, and the dead foliage flies in many a shapeless flake. Where now the real, melodious, pure and cool, and meds with life and mirth and beauty crowned, Ah, see, the unslightly slime and sluggish pool have all the solitary whale embrowned. Fled each fair form, and mute each melting sound, the raven croaks forlorn on naked spray, and, hark, the river bursting every mound, down the vale thunders, and with wasteful sway uproots the grove, and rolls the shattered rocks away. Yet such the destiny of all on earth, so flourishes and fades majestic man, fair so bad as vernal morn brings forth, and fostering gales so while the nursing fen, how oh, smile ye heavens serene, ye mildews worn, ye blighted whirlwind spares balmy prime, nor lessen of his life a little span. Born on the swift, or silent wings of time, old age comes on a pace to revenge all the climb. Be it so, Rose you plow their doom, whose hopes the grovels in the dark so drawn, and lovely so it so look beyond that whom can smile at fate and wonder how we mourn. Shall spring to we sad scenes no more return, as yonder way for sun's eternal bed, soon shall the oil and the new lustre burn, and spring shall sooner vital influence shed, again attune the grove, again adorn the mead. Shall I be left forgotten in the dust, when fate, relenting, lets the flower revive, shall nature's voice, to man alone unjust, to bid him, for doom to perish, hope to live? Is it for this fair virtue oft must strive with disappointment, pen you and pain? The heavens the mortal spring shall yet arrive, and man's majestic beauty bloom again, bright with eternal year of love, strength and rain.